Mina, how are you today? Everything good? Yes. All right. Sorry to hold you up there. You know, always working with technology. Um, yes. So I want to say uh, welcome to our martial arts experience, uh, new web live interview series that we have. And um, you have recently participated in the martial arts experience tournament, right? Yep. All right. So uh, Mina, why don't you tell everybody uh, what your name is and how old you are? Well, my name is Mina, and I'm seven years old. Seven years old. So, Mina, you were just recently the champion uh, in the in the tournament we just did, right? Yep. Yep. Okay. Now, Mina, tell everybody: um, was this your first online tournament, or um, have you done other ones? This was my second online tournament. Awesome. Okay. Okay. And how how did you like it? How, how did you like it? Well, I personally loved running through my forms and um, seeing how they looked when I did it, and I actually and I loved this competition. Wow. Okay. And uh, you uh, did you get your electronic certificate? Mommy got it. Yeah. Yes. Okay. You're just waiting on the on the prize, right? The Amazon card, right? Yes. All right. Awesome. What are you gonna get with your prize? Do you know yet? Um, I'm still thinking about what I'm going to get. Still thinking about it, yeah? All right, all right. So, Mina, tell everybody, tell our viewers, um, what what karate, what martial arts studio do you train at? I train at Dragon MMA. Okay. And where is Dragon MMA located? What state? It's in the United States. Okay. What state exactly? Oh, Pennsylvania. <laughs> Pennsylvania. And who, who are your instructors or master instructors? Master John and Sifu Lisa. Awesome. Now, Mina, how, how long have you been training with them? Um, about four years. Four years? Okay. I started when I was three. So. Wow. Oh, my goodness. You're training longer than some people, and you're only seven. <laughs> <laughs> um. So, what kind of style is it that you train in? Um, Chinese and Japanese. Kung Chinese Fu. and Japanese style. And um, what was yeah. the form? What was the form that you competed in? What style was that? Or what you know? Where did that come from? Um, I'm Chinese. Chinese. Okay. Chinese. Awesome. Awesome. And I noticed. Tai Chi piece. Okay. I noticed you have bows in your hair. Uh, do yes. you like wearing bows in your hair? Yeah. Is, is that part of your uniform? Yes. Awesome. So what belt or what sash are you? I am a brown belt. Brown belt. Wow. What what comes after brown belt? Red belt. Okay. And what after that? Black. Wow. So you're close. You're very close. So when do you think you're going to get your black sash or black belt? Mm, I think I'll get it when I'm about eight years old. In another year? Interesting. So what do you have on your schedule now? Do you have any other online tournaments coming up or any training seminars? Do I? Yeah, I have another virtual. Oh, yeah, I think I have another virtual um, competition coming up. And I still take lessons virtually with my masters. Ah. Now, did you uh, – you were training earlier today, right? Yes. Yeah, how was that? Was Did you have a good session? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, so do you have class tonight or are you done for the day? I'm done. Done for the day. Wow. You have a busy schedule. So you did training. You woke up. You got an uh, internet interview today. You're like a very busy lady. <laughs> yeah. So let me ask you, what, what do you want to be? Do you have any idea what you want to be when you grow up? Yeah, I want to be a veterinarian. Veterinarian. Wow. Now, do you know any veterinarians um, in your family or? Well, um, at my martial arts studio, there's um, a veterinarian. Um, and you love animals? Yeah, and I also have two guinea pigs. 
Oh, okay. Right. But my favorite part about when we take them to the vet, I can't wait till next year because it, they said when I'm eight years old, there's going to be like a special day and I have to be eight or older, but um, it's going to be a special day where like the kids can come in and see what vets actually do um, uh, for their job. That's awesome. That's going to be really cool. So are you done school yet? Did you guys finish up yet? Or do you still have yeah. some more classes? We're finished our school. Okay. Okay. Do you have any plans for the summer? Any, any, any trips, any swimming or? Um, we were planning to go to my cousins, um, in California and that's what our vacation I guess would be. So Mina, as, as a young competitor, how, you know, how, how has this online training experience and online tournament experience been for you, um, you know, to kind of go through this? You know, how, how do you feel about this? Um, I'm having fun at home since I don't have to wake up early usually. I usually have to wake up for school at the bell rings at 730 in the morning. So wow. I had to get up at five. So I'm kind of happy I got to um, wake up at six or seven now. So you get waking up a little bit later, get to sleep in. Yeah, and I also love the online training and stuff like that because um, I feel like it's a bit of a change from in the studio. Right. And um, it can be a little different. Right. And that's awesome that you, you like it being different. You know, that's a really, you have a really wise thought about what's going on, Mina. So, um, any, any final things you could say out here at anything, anything special you want to let the, uh, thousands of viewers that we have, uh, Mina, anything you want to share with everybody, any advice or maybe for other kids? Well, um, just keep going, keep working hard and keep, being and keep practicing that's right and i think keep smiling and if they put bows in their hair they'll be good to go right <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> so listen do me a big favor please tell mom i said thank you so much for uh, allowing us to interview you um congratulations on the championship um we might be i think we're going to be scheduling a series so uh, i think in july we're going to do another online event um, and then we have our physical tournament in September, you know, hopefully if everything works out and, uh, you know, we're able to have the tournament. So uh, we look forward to definitely seeing you again, Mina. I think you're going to have a great career. Uh, tell Master John and uh, Sensei Lisa, we said hello. Those are great instructors. Great school you're part of, okay? Thank you. All right, hon. Take care. Best of luck. And, uh, again, we had her here, the champion herself, Mina. Uh, she was our uh, seven and under champion. And we want to wish you the best and, and thank everybody for joining us today on the Martial Arts Experience. Have a great day. Bye.